see from that Stanford secondary? I know they really specialized in takeaways this season. Yeah, th- yeah that's, a, that's a really good group back there. You know, I, in, in my opinion, kind of makes that defense go. You know, you, you say mo- most defenses start from the front and work their way to the back end. I think that back end allows their defense to do a lot of, a lot of different things. You know, just and anytime you have the ability to, to play close middle and to play some man coverage and, and those guys give them the ability to do that. They've got length out there, athleticism, they can run. You know, so that's um, definitely a big challenge for us. What is it like to kind of get ready for a Thursday game, even though it's kind of a short week, even though you guys have had last week? What is, just take us through what that preparation is like for a Thursday game. Um, you know, it, it is different because of the because of the bye week. Um, you know, where normally right now you'd be really feeling crunched, and, right? And you know, late, later days than normal, and, and probably longer practices than normal, just to be able to get things in. But because of that bye week, we were we were basically able to take both weeks that you would have in pre- or a full week in preparation, and, and you, know, you spread that over a week and a half, and, and so it gives you. You know, two opportunities to get Tuesday practices, two opportunities to get Wednesday practices, and so we did spend last week with some Stanford preparation, and that made it so this week, you know, you know we, we weren't so stressed trying to get reps of different things we had in the game plan. You mentioned last week that a lot of the things in the run game you did against Colorado, you'd actually introduce some of those concepts at USC. Is part of all of this that we saw in the breakout of Colorado do as much to, to health of guys having enough bodies and people available to do what you've been wanting to do all year? Uh, I think health is, health is one, is one you, know, and, you know, Thomas Tyner is one, a good example of that where the, the first part of the year was you had some of those nagging injuries. He's full speed now. He's, he's looked really, really good in practice. He's you know, way more knowledgeable as far as the offense. And the concepts, the terminology, all those things, and so when you get those guys more and more comfortable as the season goes with what, with what they're doing, then you can start to build those packages. And, and you know, so we were able to be kind of creative with, with that stuff against Colorado, get some of those groups on the field that involve those running backs and kind of mix, mix and match them a little bit based on their skill set and maybe what their strengths are. And, um, you know, so definitely looking to continue that going forward.